hello guys welcome to today's tutorial so today we are going to start a new series technical synonym question and answer okay if you go through all the questions or all the parts of it okay i believe it, most of the questions will be coming from this series only okay and it will help you to crack the interview so this series is only concerned about technical part or technical question and answer okay and only concerned about question and answer okay so no like no detailed explanation or like this one right so this part concentrates more on basic concepts or on question testing or some uh, like modules of selenium okay what are the different components what why you are used what it is where it is used what is the some of the architecture differences so like this next part it is full of all of the commands you'll be getting in a single shot like in a single now video will be getting 90% of the synonym commands how to use them and some tricky questions around them okay and some key differences okay so let's quickly start for part one okay so what is the advantage of automation testing automation testing reduces money reduces human errors reduces human effort time okay it can uh, be automated throughout the uh, browsers multiple browsers or basically it can do parallel execution if it can do parallel execution then it will be uh, very less time consuming okay and repetitive test can be you know uh, if the test is repetitive regression smoke so you don't have to provide the support for manual it just trigger it it will serve the purpose right so what is synonym synonym is open source tool open source tool or technology or solution for browser automation right it has four component what are the different components of it id rc web driver grid right now what is synonym id synonym id is a record and playback tool comes up with a, a plugin as with firefox and it only works with firefox plugin as a firefox plugin basically it records your actions of the browser and plays it back okay now what is synonym one synonym one basically refers to a synonym rc to be specific synonym remote control it basically has two components one is synonym server okay where your browser gets launched and your automation suite gets executed with different browsers okay and other part is a client library which provide the interface between programming language and the rc server okay and what is WebDriver? WebDriver is much more advanced version compared to RC because RC was not having the couple of capabilities for handling few complex scenarios like upload, download, pop-up dialogues, all this stuff. WebDriver is much more capable, you know, to handle these things in much more proper way compared to RC. Okay. Now, what is CNM2? It's a combination of RC and CNM WebDriver. Okay, what is Selenium 3? It's the latest or current version of Selenium which is having more focus on mobile automation supported with Kiko driver for Firefox. So previously, if you need to work with Firefox, you didn't have to have Kiko driver with it. But if you have to work with Firefox on the automation front, you have to use Kiko driver. And some bug fixes also was included in the version which was existing in the previous version. Okay, what is Selenium Grid? Selenium Grid is a component of Selenium which enables you to automate or basically execute your you know, automation script in multiple different distributed system and different environment different platform different operating system in a single execution or in a parallel execution both the cases and in a remote let's say you're sitting here you can execute your, your automation scripts elsewhere somewhere else okay you can do that using grid okay now what is synonyms synonyms is a language or command that that are used as a part of you know, synonym id okay whatever command it is used that is called as synonyms why to use synonyms it's free and open source it has large user base and contributor means if many people are over the world uh, throughout the world are contributing to synonym code base making it more huge and more per feature rich and moreover synonym day by day okay it is compared with different platforms as i mentioned different uh, browsers okay and different language let's say you are expert in java you can code synonym with java somebody is in c sharp expert in c sharp so you can he or she can code with c sharp or like this so distributed sub uh, supports distributed testing basically parallel testing and remote execution okay limitations of synonym there are a couple of limitations of synonym that are there in the as of today 
so it is very much powerful in case of web based application automation okay but when it comes to native application it gets a bit you no know, uh, it doesn't support that much uh, native application automation so there you can use some third party tool as well to resolve the issue to automate some part of it okay like securely uh, auto id and like this but again signum does not have that much you no know, support for the same okay and again another thing captcha and barcode cannot be automated with selenium because it captcha and barcode are on the fly comes up on the fly so it cannot be automated okay so different type of locators that are used in selenium there are four type of locators id css name class name tag name link test special text link test xpath okay now why what is xpath xpath is a mechanism of locator finding strategy which is very much useful to handle no dynamic element let's say you are element you are having some web element let's say a text box that text box id is changing dynamically okay how can you handle with that how can you find that if it is changing dynamically and if you cannot find that you cannot interact with that right so to handle those kind of scenarios xpath is very handy now next question that might come to you which one is faster id css or xpath id is the faster because it has a unique attribute if it is css then it is much more compared to id it is slower and it is x if it is xpath it is obviously it is very slow compared to css and id because xpath scans the html page node actually or tag okay what you mention and it goes to each of the node mentioned by your xpath and so that's why it makes the script slower right language is supported by cnm is java c sharp ruby python java script and suppose you are asked to explain the framework or like not framework architecture of rc then this is the uh, picture you can refer to you have a client libraries using client libraries let's say you have in java python dotnet page etc you can develop your test script that test script gets converted to java script and that java script hits the rc server remote control server and the through, through server your nodes are registered right your nodes are registered and you can execute your automation script in any of the browser or all of the browser depending on your requirement so that's all guys from this section part 1 if you do like my video please share like and subscribe to my channel if you have any question please put them in the comment box i'll be happy to help thank you and have a nice day